Hello my dear students. Today we in this module will talk about symmetry. We will learn about what is symmetry. Symmetry is such a nice thing students that in every field of activity we use symmetry, the idea of symmetry. Even nature has gifted us some symmetrical objects. Students, have you ever observed a butterfly carefully or have you ever observed leaves? Okay, student, look at the screen. I am drawing a leaf over here. So, if I draw a line in the middle this way and I try to fold it, these two parts will coincide. This line is line of symmetry. So, this is a symmetrical object. This leaf is symmetrical. Let us understand with another example. Here students you can see this is a paper right. It is rectangular in shape. Now, if I fold it about this line see these two parts coincide each other exactly you can see. So, this line is called line of symmetry. Now, if I fold it like this about this line, again students you can see these two parts coincide exactly. So, this is its line of symmetry and this is also its line of symmetry. Now, let us talk about polygons. Polygons you have seen the example of a polygon right now I showed you polygon actually is a closed figure made up of line segments. Now, we will talk about regular polygons. Can somebody tell me what is a regular polygon? Can you give me example of a regular polygon? Okay, Sarthak? Square. Yes, very good. Square is a regular polygon. A regular polygon is a polygon in which all the sides are of equal length and all the angles are of equal measure. Now, let us understand with the help of a example. Here students I have drawn a square. As you know square has four sides. Square is a regular polygon. All the sides are equal. Now, let us find out how many lines of symmetry are there. 1 if I join 2 diagonals here 1 another line of symmetry here again third line of symmetry then if I draw a line horizontally a line of symmetry is there. So, it has 4 lines of symmetry. If we take an equilateral triangle look at the screen students here I am drawing an equilateral triangle it has 3 sides, all the sides are equal. Now, try to find out lines of symmetry, one from the vertex of one side and we will join it to the midpoint of the opposite side. Second line and third line. So, triangle has 3 lines of symmetry. Now, if we take an example of hexagon, hexagon has 6 sides, 6 equal sides. Now, if we draw line of symmetry, we will get 6 lines of symmetry. So, we can say a regular polygon has as many lines of symmetry as the number of sides it has. Ok students, now if we take an example of hexagon, hexagon has 6 equal sides. So, it will have 6 lines of symmetry. Clear to you? Now, let us take some letters of English alphabet whether they are symmetrical or not. Students look at the screen here I have drawn A. So, this is the line of symmetry of alphabet A. Now, B this is the line of symmetry of letter B about which if I fold it two parts will coincide exactly. This is the line of symmetry of letter C. Here I have written letter E. So, this is the line of symmetry of letter E. C, the line of symmetry of U. Now, let us take V. 
this is the line of symmetry of letter V. Here now I have taken the alphabet X. So, this is the line of symmetry of X and this is also. Now students this is clear to you how we can find out the line of symmetry of an object. So, the line of symmetry of a figure is a line about which when we fold the object the two parts coincide each other exactly. Student this is clear to you? Ok students revise whatever you have learnt today, I will meet you in the next class. So students before moving on to the next module, let us recap what we have learnt in this module. A polygon is said to be regular if all its sides are of equal length and all its angles are of equal measure. Each regular polygon has as many lines of symmetry as it has sides. To watch the next video students answer the following questions. Question number 1, a polygon is said to be regular if options are A, all its sides are of equal length, B, all its angles are of equal measure, C, both A and B, D, none of these. Question number 2, how many lines of symmetry are there in a hexagon? Options are A, infinite, B, 4, C, 5, D, 6. Question number 3, which of the following alphabets have two lines of symmetry? Options are A, letter A, B, letter F, C, letter H, D, letter Y.